Manchester City's hard fought 2 0 win over Newcastle United. A recap Manchester City earned a hard fought victory over Newcastle United in their recent Premier League match at Eddie Hodd Stadium. Phil Foden and Bernardo Silva were the heroes for City as they scored the two goals that sealed the win for the home team. City started the game on the back foot as Newcastle tried to take the game to them. However, Foden's individual brilliance gave City the lead in the 15th minute when he darted inside Newcastle's Dan Byrne to score a deflected finish via Sven Batman. Newcastle had their chances to equalise through Callum Wilson and Joe Linton, but they were unable to convert. Silva came off the bench to score City's second goal in the 67th minute. He converted Erling Haaland's pass with typical tenacity after hurrying Newcastle goalkeeper Nick Pope into a poor clearance. Newcastle had their chances in the game, with Joe Willock and Alexander Isaac making an impact after coming off the bench. However, Ruben Dias, Ederson, and Nathan Ake made some brave challenges to deny Newcastle's attackers. The win takes City 5 points clear of Arsenal, who won their game in hand against Everton in midweek. However, City will need more moments of magic from players like Foden if they are to overtake Arsenal in the title race. Defensively, City's most robust back four at the moment is Kyle Walker, Manuel Akinji, Ruben Dias, and Nathan Ake. However, their shortcomings in possession compared to John Stones, Imeric Laporte, and teenager Rico Lewis mean that they have to do more defending. This conundrum and how Guardiola deals with it might define City's season at home and abroad. Meanwhile, Newcastle's lack of goals is becoming a major problem for them as they threaten to undermine their top four bid. They have not scored in their last eight Premier League matches, and their inability to convert their chances against City might prove costly in the long run. In conclusion, City's win over Newcastle was hard fought, but it was a vital one as they continue their push for the Premier League title. With players like Foden and Silva in form, they will be confident of closing the gap on Arsenal and winning the title once again. Despite Newcastle's valiant effort, it was Manchester City who came out on top with a hard fought 2-0 victory over the Magpies. Phil Foden's stunning solo goal in the first half set the tone for the game, with Newcastle unable to convert their chances in front of goal. Bernardo Silva's late goal sealed the deal for the citizens, who extended their lead at the top of the Premier League table. The win was particularly important for City, as Arsenal had won their game in hand earlier in the week, extending their lead at the top of the table to five points. With just a few months left in the season, every win is crucial for City as they look to retain their title and hold off the chasing pack. One of the standout performers for City in the game was their defense, which has been a major talking point this season. Manager Pep Guardiola has experimented with a hybrid fullback system, but against Newcastle's physicality, he opted for a more robust back four of Kyle Walker, Manuel Akinji, Ruben Dias, and Nathan Ake. The quartet put in a solid defensive performance, with Dias and Ake particularly impressive in their over my dead body work in their own penalty area. However, the quartet's shortcomings in possession compared to Stones, Laporte, and teenager Rico Lewis meant more defending had to be done as the ball kept coming back in dangerous areas. 
against quality opposition, this conundrum, and how Guardiola deals with it might define City's season at home and abroad. On the other hand, Newcastle's clear problem lies in their inability to convert their chances in front of goal. Despite their valiant effort and improved performance from last season, they have failed to score a single goal since the turn of the year. Wilson and Joe Linton both had glorious chances to equalize for Newcastle but failed to capitalize. If they continue to struggle in front of goal, their top four bid could be fatally undermined. Overall, it was a hard-fought victory for Manchester City, who showcased their defensive solidity and attacking talent. With Arsenal breathing down their necks, every win is crucial for City in their bid to retain their title. Meanwhile, Newcastle's struggles in front of goal continue, and they will need to start converting their chances if they are to have any hope of finishing in the top four.